I feel very lucky that I get to go into so many different environments and I might not know anything about what's being said. I can do a little bit of research to make sure I've got some of the key terms down. I've never done two meetings that are the same. I, I get to learn on the job. I'm Dana Bowers and I am a visual facilitator or sometimes called a graphic recorder. So I go into other people's meetings and I draw out, map out what they're talking about in real time. I wake up and the first thing I do is make a pot of coffee. I really like a slow start and just sip in that coffee for as long as possible. I always want something hot to help wake me up later in the day, but I can't have too much caffeine because then I won't fall asleep. So I do decaf coffee in the afternoon. I work with a really diverse set of people. I have worked with corporations, I've worked with nonprofits, community centers. My favorite folks to work with are social justice uh, organizations. I really think it's helpful for those who are participating in that work to be able to see what they're talking about and reflect on what's happening. Yeah, those are my favorite groups to work with. I get asked to come into meetings for a lot of different reasons. Sometimes it's just to bring like a creative vibe or to uh, make a Zoom meeting or something that's routine, just add a little bit more literal color to the meeting. Most people are visual learners. They aren't just auditory learners. It's really helpful to have people feel heard. You can feel really validated when something that you've said is placed on the board. And I'm there to put what is resonating in the room on the board. So I'm not just going to put what the boss says on the board, it'll be from anybody. What I get asked the most about graphic recording, people often say they've never heard of it, but they think it's a great idea and it should be everywhere. <laughs> I've always been a note taker. I People always asked for my notes in school. I have always loved hand lettering and I have been an improviser for a long time. In 2018, I reached out to a person who I saw doing graphic recording for an event. When they saw that I had improv experience, they said, wow, that means that you can listen deeply, you know how to go with the flow, and so let's give it a shot. So I I started in 2018, but feels like uh, all of my experiences led me to this work. I think that one of the reasons why I really like doing this work is that it democratizes meetings, that everyone has the opportunity to get their idea on the chart. Uh, it's not just going to prioritize who is the highest ranking, highest paid person in the room. When you hear that, oh, <laughs> in the room, yeah, then you know that people are in agreement about that and that's something that's going to go on the chart. You, you really have to stay present and just make the most meaningful mark that's as fast as possible and move on and keep, keep listening and, and stay present with what's happening in the meeting.